So I'm using a new brush for the first time. The thing with this brush, the texture is like really mm, spackly. It's good for the first layer, but the second layer, it makes it nice and clownish, so it works for this. And I took some black cream and rub it under my eyes and just blend that out. Some red cream, which be careful, some people are very sensitive to that. Blend that out. And I also use some red eyeshadow to set that. Now for some face paint, I'm trying to make my eyes look nice and shiny and glossy without the gloss. So you just dab a few lines and then you dab it out with your fingertips to make it nice and blurry, you know, not too stark. And then you keep doing that and then for the last stroke, you just don't dab it at all, you just leave it and that kind of make it look like it's shining. You come back and you set the black under it, under my eyes. Alright, so I'm choosing some random colors. I'm choosing the Wonder Bread colors, which is the yellow, a red, and blue, which is basically the primary colors. Um, and kind of dab that out. It, it kind of make it look clownish to me. I also put some black to make it more grimy instead of just, you know, elementary colors. And do the same Pennywise thing everyone has been doing on YouTube. I decided to join a trend. Usually I don't follow trends, but you know what? I never did a clown look. So it's now or never. I mean, it makes no sense doing it next year, right? I drew in some extra lashes. Not to make it girly, just to make it artistic. You know, it was, it was just an artistic kind of thing. You know, you do the top part like you usually supposed to do. And on the next, I also made it shiny underneath as well. You know, not just on top of my eyes. And now it just looks stylistic instead of um, glossy. And I am okay with that. Now for your favorite part, the nose. You do like normal you know cover your nose with some red cream and then set it i made it look like a gradient as well i just didn't want it to like you know just there i also put a shine there you crisscross i almost got into song there i'm um, drawing your normal lips but make the cupid's bow really pointy and make sure you connect the the lips to the lines now with some black eyeshadow um, do this as messy as you want, but I just blend it out into a nice cat eye all the way into my hairline. And for the, you know, first generation of Pennywise movie, whatever, I put in some eyebrows. Because, I don't know, it looks nice. It fills some space. I like filling up space. But on those 301s. And I wanted some gloss. So I put on some gloss. This is wet and wild by the way, it goes over wet and wild really well. I also put it over my nose to make it nice and shiny. Yay! <laughs> yes, done. like the way how this came out. Um, everyone's doing something different with the Pennywise look, but I got the Ronald McDonald hair. Um, it's basically like the first Pennywise. Also, the music in the background is kind of a spoof of, you know, what beauty gurus do. <laughs> but I'm doing it in clown makeup, so I thought it was, I thought it was hilarious. Subscribe, comment, thumbs up my video, support my Patreon. Okay, I love you. Bye, bye. Eh, <laughs> <laughs>